Hey Collective, it's your girl Ratchet Oracle 22. Welcome to my channel. Y'all, this is going to be our daily message for today, April 16th, 2023. I might shuffle weird because I was just cleaning up and trying to open something for my child and ended up cutting my finger. Um, but y'all, I am on day 16 of fruit juices only fresh pressed fruit juice i'm currently drinking some water because i ain't got no more fruit so i gotta drink what i got but y'all highly highly recommend if you're seeking clarity in any type of situation um i'm going 44 days so almost halfway there but not quite um so Y'all, make sure y'all hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and also hit the notification bell if you want to be notified when the readings are posted on my channel. I'm using my little RBG lights today. Don't know why I felt led to do that, but hey, we going with the flow, all right? So let's see what spirit has for us right now. I'm kind of getting the message that people know you came from nothing, they know you had to struggle to get to where you were, but they still jealous of you. It's like, how are you jealous when I had to go through hell and high water just to get here, is what I'm hearing. Like, you, if you had to walk a mile in my shoes, you wouldn't survive. And maybe that's why they jealous, collective. Why is this card? I don't know what done happened to this card. This is the tower card, but it looks funny to them. All right, let's see. Spirit, what do you have for the collective today? First card out is the Ace of Pentacles in reverse, okay? So somebody's stability is being uprooted, okay? There is a major transformation happening in someone's life. Spirit, who is this? Who is this that's going through? Okay. It is the page of wands that fell out, okay? Um, then we also have the six of cups here. So somebody's, something about a child, okay? The page of wands is a child or inner child card. And then you have the six of cups here, okay? Something about going back to your childhood or healing some childhood traumas. I feel like someone's stability is uprooted because they've kind of been running from the some either running from responsibilities or running from some childhood traumas, okay? And here we have Scorpio and fire sign energy. So this could be you could be a fire or water element, but I feel like someone came in Okay, this, this could go several ways, Collective. Either you were stable and you met someone and you had a lot of deeply rooted traumas, especially if you're a fire sign or a water sign, and this person came in and mirrored all of those traumas and kind of uprooted you, okay? So you could have met this person and then your life began to go through a lot of changes really fast, a lot of transformations really fast, okay? And for others of you, this could be someone that's on your mind that's a fire or a water sign. And this person right now, their stability could be being uprooted, okay? This person could be losing a job, losing a home, um, being separated from someone um, that they depended on for some type of resources. And the reason that this is happening is because their child is number one. And then number two is because they really do need to do some inner child healing, okay? Let's see what Spirit has to say about this. Spirit, clarify. Look what came out. The 10 of... Y'all, I cut myself and it burns. The 10 of swords in reverse, okay? So someone's refusal to let go, someone's inability to let go of their toxic ways, their childhood ways, and to let go of the past is causing them to go through a major transformation where they have to be uprooted. Because when you don't move, spirit will move you, okay? 
and someone is holding on to some childhood traumas. This Six of Cups card in this reading is something of the past. Someone can't let go of something that happened to them in the past, okay? And for some of you, this is an ex, and this ex can't let go of you, okay? Because you rejected their love offer with that Ace of Pentacles in reverse, okay? But someone doesn't know how to walk away from something that just keeps hurting them. It's crazy because the Ten of um, Swords in reverse is somebody being stabbed over and over and over, betrayed over and over and over, and not knowing how to let go. And possibly because you have attachment issues, okay? You don't know how to detach. Either you or your person has attachment issues. Because there's a codependent situation going on here. Someone could have grew up with a toxic mother or father or grew up without a mother or father. And someone needs to learn how to parent themselves. And for some of you, this is the parent of your child. But it's, a, it's very crazy how the reading is coming because it's like someone can't let go of something that happened in their childhood. So they're just going through life and pushing that toxicity off on everybody they meet, okay? They're blaming everybody for what their mother or father or parents did to them, okay? Someone's eyesight is being affected, okay? What else, spirit? But someone's definitely missing you, okay? They're not happy, they're not stable, they're not committed, yeah, there are the Six of Pentacles in reverse. Someone that is having money issues, okay? The Six of Pentacles in reverse and the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Collective, your person is having money issues, okay? And with this Six of Cups, they can't get you off their mind. With the Ten of Swords in reverse, they can't let you go. With the Page of Wands here, they feel as if you guys were meant to be together. They definitely want to... Um, they want to have a new beginning with you. Pages are like aces. They're new beginnings. So this person is going through it, okay? They, they're they lacking stability. They're lacking security. They're constantly being uprooted, okay? Because where, wherever they planted their seeds, they planted seeds in non-fertile soil. So when you try to plant seeds in non-fertile soil, those roots don't connect, okay? And that's what happens. It's like whatever foundation they thought they had built, built, it's not solid. It's not secure. The roots are rotting, okay? And someone's having to move and someone's being uprooted. And they're thinking, how did I get myself here? They can't get you off their mind. They can't let you go, okay? They're, they, they're, they're having money issues with the Six of Pentacles in reverse, okay? They're not receiving any blessings with the Six of Pentacles in reverse. The bottom of the deck here, the Justice card in reverse, this person is not receiving any blessings, okay? Things, this person feels like things are not fair. But in all actuality, the scales are actually being balanced, okay? Because this person may have came into your life. <laughs> yeah, this could definitely be a Cancer Scorpio Pisces with this King of Cups. This person may have came into your life with this very emotionally detached energy, okay? So I feel like you could have loved this person. You could have been all in emotional. And you probably are a person who naturally is emotionally detached. But this person came in your life and helped you open your heart chakra. And this could have been the first person that you were able to be vulnerable, vulnerable with. The first person that you were able to let in your heart. And then this person kind of just, they came into your life, but they were emotionally unavailable, okay? They could not provide for your emotional needs and they could not connect to you emotionally. Even, their, their, even though their heart and their emotions told them that you were the one, they wouldn't accept it, okay? Yeah, nine of swords energy here, okay? The ground is bleeding in this card. I told you that they planted, someone planted seeds in unfertile soil, okay? The soil has no nutrients, so the seeds aren't rooting. The, the, it's not, the seeds are just rotting. They're not doing anything, okay? They're, this person is not able to manifest, Knight of Wands in reverse. This is that Leo Aries Sagittarius card again, okay? This person is slow 
when it and not slow like that this person is slow when it comes to making decisions so this person has known for a long time look at the bottom of the deck here the three of swords okay this person has known for a long time that you are the person that they needed to be with you are the person that they were meant to be with but this person with the nine of the knight of wands in reverse this person is very slow they don't move fast they don't follow their intuition they're emotionally detached okay so this person is going through the same heartbreak that they put you through okay and a part of the heartbreak is the fact that they're realizing they broke their own heart they're realizing that you were the best thing that ever happened to them and they thought they could replace you collective they thought they could find you in someone else and it turns out that that person was a fraud turns out that that person was a fraud yeah the moon card this upcoming new moon and taurus eclipse is going to be significant for this person this person is depressed okay this person is definitely depressed okay seven of cups here meanwhile you have a lot of options and you don't even know if that's the option you want anymore you have a lot of options okay and you don't know if they they are even included in these options okay the seven of cups is a um Scorpio card yet again yeah two of wands collective you have some decisions to make this person is slowly coming back into your life slowly trying to make them their move I definitely get a feeling that this person could have like um text you on social media from a ghost page but they didn't let you know it was them they tried to act like they was somebody else someone has a fake page or someone's texting your phone someone's definitely watching you okay and you have a decision to, be, to make about whether you're going to let this person back in your life and whether you're going to give this person another chance okay but this person is watching you and I feel like you glowing up and they watching you glowing up and they like, damn, I'm not a part of that. Okay. And they see that other people are watching you too. And people, other people are interested in you. Yes. Be careful. Queen of swords. Okay. You, you had a lot of repressed pain when this person separated from you. Now this is their energy. Okay. They, they separated from you, moved on immediately to someone else, repressed the pain from not being with you convinced themselves that they were okay and they didn't need you and now look begging for you back with the five of pentacles here okay begging for stability and security back because they ain't been stable or secure damn this is a scorpio okay scorpio done came out several times in this reading but they ain't been happy or secure since you were in their life okay now they're experiencing endings okay but this is a death and reverse because you got the death card and then which is death and reverse and then you have the ace of cups here this person wants to end something somewhere else to get a new beginning with you because they believe you are the empress they believe you are the high priestess okay this person wants to move on to calmer waters with the six of swords and you were calm you were their peace the king of pentacles they want stability again they want to you some of you could be a business owner you could just be on top of your shit you don't need nobody you on top of your game okay you could be an entrepreneur and this this person is attracted to that okay this person wants to be more like you okay they kind of want to be a power couple all right the hangman car right here yeah this person waited so long you don't even know if you want this person anymore the five of swords this person betrayed you okay and now this person is being betrayed by other people the queen of wands you could definitely be a aries leo or sagittarius but just like i said you on your shit collective okay you and the queen of wands energy you've ascended okay you committed to something with this seven of pentacles okay you put in a lot of hard work to get where you are and to overcome the heartbreak that this person caused you you received a lot of clarity with the ace of swords here okay you have a very clear picture of what you want for your life okay this person is having to go through the hermit okay the the solitude this person ghosted you and left you in solitude and during that phase of solitude you learned a lot about yourself okay look tower card in reverse you no longer in that tower card energy knight of cups here this person thought they was the shit okay that's what i have for you collective peace